welcome back. Whether you're a trade professional or DIYer, there may be a time when you need to drill a large hole through brickwork. That could be for fitting dryer vents, soil pipes, boiler flues, and more. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the best results using our range of Adax diamond core bits. They're made from premium grade materials with cooling slots to help drilling and dust extraction. During drilling, these diamond infused 10 mil segments cut a clean hole through masonry and concrete blocks. Because they've been laser welded into place, they will last a long time. Even when drilling through tough bricks and concrete. It's crucial that you pick the right size of core bit before you start, as it can be very difficult to make a hole larger, especially if you want a clean and tidy finish. The Adax range has core bits from 22 to 152 mil. After you've picked the bit for your job, you'll need an adapter to attach it to a drill. We have half inch hex and SDS adapters, so it doesn't matter if you've got a combi drill or SDS plus tool. But using core bits can be dangerous, so make sure your drill has a safety clutch. You should also be wearing suitable PPE. Now it's time to start drilling. Step one, mark on the wall where you'd like the center of the hole to be. Make sure that there are no pipes or wires inside the wall before you start drilling. Step two, screw the core onto an adapter or Adax cores have a half inch BSP fit. Then insert either a tapered pilot rod or drill bit into the center. Step three, place the pilot drill onto the mark and start drilling. To make drilling cavity walls and hard materials easier, drill a 13mm hole straight through the wall with an SDS bit. This will be used to guide the core as it drills. Then place the pilot rod into the pre-drilled hole. Step 4. Using a diamond core bit on a hammer action will damage it, reducing its lifespan, so make sure that all tools are set to rotary action only. Step 5. Start drilling by applying gentle pressure, letting the bit do the work, until the pilot drill pierces the other side of the wall. If you have access to both sides of the wall, stop drilling. If not, carry on drilling until the core has gone all the way through. Step six, place the pilot drill or rod into the hole on the other side and drill back towards the center of the wall. This will stop the face of the wall being damaged giving a clean and smooth hole afterwards. Once the hole has been fully drilled, remove the slug from the centre. And there you have it, a perfectly clean hole with minimal effort. If you've got to drill through a cavity wall but only have access to one side, we have 240mm extension rods to help. Simply drill the hole in two parts using the extension rod to reach inside the cavity. Pilot rods and drills can become wedged inside the adapter, so use a taper drift to remove it. Our premium core bits and accessories are available individually, and we also have a five piece diamond core kit which is everything that you'll need, including five of the most popular core bit sizes in a wheelable aluminium case. It's ideally suited for drilling into building materials such as aerated and concrete blocks and soft natural stone. Click below for the full range or visit our website to find a stockist near you. Thanks for watching and see you next week.